welcome those who are joining us tonight in our night of prayer as well as Bible study. For those who are joining us, you can find us on the website at www.fhachickory.org, as well as YouTube and our Facebook. I don't know about many of you, but in these last few days, as I've been looking at the news, I cannot help but notice all the red numbers that I've been seeing lately in regards to the coronavirus. I was looking at the news this morning, and I cannot help but to be thinking about America, to be thinking about particularly New York State. And I believe the governor has not only issued a state of emergency, but the numbers that we have been seeing about the death have been rising. The good news is that the hospitalization or infected rate has calmed down or flattened as many statistics have been shown. coronavirus. California, Texas, Minnesota, the Midwest state, in the high level, the she, Takinagula Shai News, Shai Tolu State, New York, there are a lot of challenges. Oh, yeah, Lu State, New York, Tokyo, Governor, President Donald Trump, I saw most serious two weeks. I cannot help but to think about affected. Governor Roy Cooper especially ไอ้ไอ้เตจิมอนันจีแคมเปญยอตอมูชันโดลอจิซอมโมโดคออลูวีโอยอลอตอนเตงนายออลูวีโอตูกามอนนอยอหัวฟาเกอลิมิกาล
two weeks, two weeks to figure out and to sort out how they are going to fund everyone. And so I want to let all the parents know that Lou has been canceled. Tonight, we're going to dive into prayer. After prayer, then we will dive into our Bible study. Or some of you have been praying, but I don't think that we should stop praying, especially for the coronavirus, especially for this pandemic. According to the CDC and according to the statistics, in America, there are over 425,000 confirmed cases of the coronavirus. And there are almost 15,000 deaths that have occurred. So I want to let you know this is something that as a country we need to be praying for. ตัวยาอบัยทวันจุตมอนอเจยิงยอทวันจุทวันจุปาโตตุกามอโครโนไวรัสนอกอนอยาเตนิปลอมมูเตลีนอจุยิงไฮจอเจออลูอันทีวย
Obe to van chu, to van chu o jong te tierli. Te ying chi pao ka yo hai li cha. Chi pao ka yo si. Lu i li, lu o li, mu to lu pei li. The first quarter of yong no tu. Te pei mu to lu plau li la. Te van chu, te ying chi pao ka hai te tu coronavirus na o. Yeah, it's a good thing to do. Especially to take me calendar. No, Charlie just hunter no more. Blow up on and go cheat. So, a more coronavirus for loose state. So, especially work. Bunch for ya chung do not pay in your tsa. The state of New York, we lift up our brothers and our sisters in New York to you. They have suffered tremendous loss as of Tuesday evening. They have suffered more than 1,500 deaths within a 24-hour period, Lord. And so we come before you tonight and we ask, Lord, that may your hands be upon the state of New York, followed by New Jersey, the two states who have the most infected coronavirus confirmed cases, as well as the most death. Lord, we don't know how long this quarantine will last. But we ask in your name, Jesus, that may you be with those families who have experienced loss, grief, and are currently grieving today, Lord. For we do not know any words of encouragement to share with them. All we can do is just to sit and to stand and watch as lives are taken Banchu, Tagombli, your families or to come on not all saw. Your family members or to Tashi name. Ele Montau Chando ya gain your sheer gains or sheer Takanda. Your families don't know. Chitali no la Banchu, Bain Yatsa, President Donald Trump, the Trump administration as they are working through the bills, signing off bills, fighting this virus. We pray that you'll be with the Trump administration, that you will grant them the idea that they need. We come before you tonight, Lord, and we lift up the Hmong District of the Christian and Missionary Alliance, in particular, the leadership. They have just announced this past week that they have decided to cancel the Hmong District Annual Conference because the coronavirus there are no other options, Lord. But for the safety of the people, the leadership team have made this decision. And there will be a lot of challenges for the leadership team since we do not have a district annual conference this year. We pray, Lord, that you'll be with Dato Yasihu, Dato Ya, Dexcom members. Kalo, Yomolu Chu Yi, a young no chi mo don't tell us you young law. Let you find out a way. Especially to obey Hopoko Hong churches. Ipo Ningo, Ipanjing, Wan Chu. Talk on Dato Yasihu. 
ดาโรจอนเนี่ยซื้อคือดาโตจะจานซื้อวัดป้าตัวเปิ้นจิงจะเปิ้นจิงเนี่ยตัวเปโฮปโกโฮมงเอกาเลยเนี่ยตาวเ
Wow. What does it mean to be God-breathed? It means to have inspiration. A lot of times you guys are thinking that to be inspired means it's something from the bottom of your stomach or your heart coming out, right? The actual word God-breathed means to exhale, to blow out, actually. In fact, God, the ideas that God had in mind that no man could have ever thought to, could ever think to write, God put them in man to write his words. And so, let's go to the whiteboard here, and we're going to take a look and recap what we saw last week. We're going to recap what we saw last week. Yeah, the sun Wednesday or tall or not, I got to a baker lean the night. You go recap to pay ya. You go to get your pillow shack or pillow go. That's all ya. Vanchu, father. Son and the Holy Spirit. Van Chu Chong Dining Dining Li Lang Tu. People like who? People like Moses. People like Paul. Chong no ning la shi chong dining li lang tu na ya. Dining li mose. Dining li a jan polo. Dining li yo ha. The Father is God. The Son is God. The Holy Spirit is God. God, three persons in one. They influence people like Moses. Or people like Paul, Ajan Paulo, influence Mose la she influence Ajan Paulo, influence to write. Moses wrote the first five books of the Old Testament, while Paul wrote several epistles or letters. Of the New Testament. And so you can see, I think he probably wrote close to eight or even nine letters. God inspired Moses, inspired Paul, influenced them to write his words. Now we learned last week, Wednesday, ก็จะให้เตะเอยาวันจุชงติเนงลีมอเซลอชอจีพอวาโลกูกูทะเทอจีพอนเดอคีเกงลอชีลอชงอาจารย์ปอลโลลอชอาจารย์ปอลโลจ
the writing of the first version autographs are the inspired words of God. Inspired words of God. Inspiration. Original. La show to lu Hebrew, la she Aramaic, la she Greek gili e. Ya be more shy, ma Gunjang had the Bay of Mong, ya being chito tau had the Greek gili e haranchi, la she Hebrew lu, tai tau li jay haranchi, la she Aramaic, ho yali jana ya. Original autograph, the last week, Bella Shaita, Bella Paul, from Last week, my wife had 15, 11. That's your good, your gay, like, yeah, 16. These manuscripts were copied, and there was a king by the name of James. King James. He had wanted to translate the Bible because he knew English only. He didn't know Hebrew, Aramaic, or Greek and so he gathered some of the scholars who knew Aramaic, Greek, and Hebrew, and he gathered them together to create what we call the King's James Version Bible. King's James Version Bible. Uh, English writing or Old English Kingdom of English writing, right? And so in Bible and Christian uh, theology, we call this the King James Version or the first modern version of the Bible. I modern modern King James. They didn't know Greek Hebrew, and so they gathered the scholars together to come up with an English version Bible, and they named it after the king, King James. King James Version. But I want us to understand how you came to have the Bible, what you have, or how the Bible came into existence. And so I want us to pay attention to this part right here. King's James Version is considered a word for word translation word for word translation meaning that the english version the words are trying to translate the hebrew the aramaic and the greek 
into word-for-word translation. And so we call this category the word-for-word translation. That's the principle that they used. James Hebrew Greek to Aramaic. Greek Aramaic Hebrew category word for word one to one ratio as close as possible to the original autograph copies or manuscript though some of you may have different versions of the bible i want you to open your bible and look at the different version that you have with you and you may be wondering hey i have the english standard version the english standard version is an actual word for word translation so it belongs in this category and it was established in 2001 the english standard version came out published in 2001 hebrew and greek word for word Paul English Standard Version English translate word for word. If you have a study Bible like the NASB version, the New American Standard Bible, it also belongs in the word for word. In fact, the New Standard American Bible version came out in the 60s, 1960. New American Standard Bible. Many of you may have a version that is called the New International Version, the NIV. It's a very popular version. NIV, New International Version. The New International Version is unique in what sense? New unique linda na. New chia word for word translation. The she new ya thought for thought. Translation, the NIV, thought for thought. And the NIV came out in the 70s, 1973, if I'm correct. New International Version. Now, these are two different principles. These are two different principles of translating the Word of God from the original language. The first principle of translation is word for word. This is very close to the original, trans, uh, trans, uh, uh, original wording. Thought for thought is a bit further down. It's not as close as word for word, but its focus is to have the same thoughts and ideas. It tends to be not word-centered, but it tends to be sentence-centered. Nah. Thought for thought. Jelu, Hebrew, Jelu, Greek, Jelu, Aramaic, original autograph manuscript. The NIV. Lashi, New International Version. Dishi Benuho, Shaito, okay, no, su, gay, tipe, the non, eh, yaranchi. Gay, tipe, the no, jay, ya, Mikalalu, hai, de, ya, 
paraphrase. Mong peng chi mo lo lu paraphrase ye ku chi pa ka yo chai to be li cha de shi ye ku ha chai lin de no ya. Paraphrase lo lu paraphrase chai lu mong ye ya hai de tao tu wa nying wa lo ku po wa lo ku hi bru ngui te i เอ่อเอ่อเอ่อเอ่อเอ่อเอ่อเอ่อเอ่อเอ่อเอ่อเอ่อเอ่อเอ่อเอ่อเอ่อเอ่อเอ่อเอ่อเอ่อเอ่อ
It is a paraphrase of a paraphrase. Paul Mong Mong Da Tia Paul Mong Lang Tili Itit Yo Po Yo Yo Ya Hopo Ko Mong Tia Tom Mong Rong Tia Pei Ya Si Hu Mong Ma Jo Wan Ju Zo Lu Anki Good News Translation La Tai I Lu Di Do Lu Mong Tai I Lu Di Do Lu Mong ไทยตาลีนอนน่ะพ่อนอฮอดเดอะไทยอีลือเลยเทะไทยตาลีนอนน่ะ news translation Ponga news translation Thailand original Hebrew thing Greek เอ่อตื่นยาวิลินเตอร์ทอกันยิงพ่อม้องตะกันยิงพ่ออังกีมาซัมไทม์พ่ออังกีมาเนยอมเม่งตัวพ่อม้องซัมไทม์กันยิง
category versions as well as multiple categorized versions of the Bible. And I find it oftentimes different version or translate Try to always read only the English uh, version. You might want to try reading the Hmong version per se. I think a lot of times we are uh, we only know one one version of the Bible and we, we keep to our dear heart one version only, right? But it is my cautionary. Don't just study from one version, study from multiple versions. Uh, you can easily access these different versions online. And sometimes when you're studying God's word, it is highly recommended that you pay attention to the different versions because it will ultimately help you discern God's truth for today, tomorrow, and what is to come. During this coronavirus era, read different versions of the text. If you're studying from Genesis chapter 12, I recommend you read four or five different versions. ยาเตกอยอลอกเกอเทยอลอตังเกอวะลอกูญอตอฮอจิกิงชงเนงโกชงโกออนะกูขอเกสาตุกอมายาลินอชิทซอยิงพงมงซึญิงพออังกียากอ
ตอนนี้ตอนนี้ตอนนี้ตอนนี้ตอนนี้ตอนนี้ตอนนี้ตอนนี้ตอนนี้ตอนนี้ตอนนี้ตอนนี้ตอนนี้ตอนนี้ต